Hi gardening friends, it's Travis from Louisville, Kentucky, Zone 6B. Uh, this is part two of my seed or indoor seed starting video for 2021. So in this video, using the uh, Jiffy greenhouse pellet trays again, um, remember 15 cups of warm water will expand your whole tray. It doesn't take very long at all. I've already peeled back the mesh um, around them. And in this video, we are starting hollyhocks. So these are a couple of varieties I got from Baker Creek. This is the first year I bought anything from Baker Creek. So we, we will see how they do. Um, I was really excited to find this variety. It's like a peach peach pink color um, double champagne and then this one is double carnival rosy red so uh, you guys probably already know this from last year I love hollyhocks um, I grew the black variety last year what well, not jet black but like a dark dark purple really is what it was so those were successful. They actually even bloomed for me the first season. And I'm going to try these two varieties this year. Um, I love hollyhocks. My grandma always had these when I was a kid. Um, all kinds of hollyhocks. Um, they were so pretty. So these kind of remind me of her. So they're kind of sentimental. So anyway, let's dive into it. Um, I'm going to go by these two rows and these two rows. So these uh, rows, I will start the Hollyhock Champagne and this side I will do the Carnival Rosy Red. Alright, so let's open these guys up and see what they look like. I'm pretty sure they all look the same. These are a good size seed. And they give you quite a bit. Baker Creek. Hollyhock seeds. Double champagne. That's what the seeds look like. Alright. So let's read the back of the thing. It's saying to um, direct sow these. But we're going to start them indoors. And I think that is probably the reason I got such good blooms from, you know, starting them a little bit early. Um, sow seeds a fourth inch deep and keep the soil moist, obviously. Uh, hollyhocks prefer full sun, of course. So I'm going get, to get to planting these in the tray. Again, a fourth inch, a fourth of an inch deep. So here we go. I'm going to put probably two seeds per pellet. You guys probably don't want to watch this part. I actually don't mind it. I like watching other people um, plant stuff. So, yeah. So, if it's kind of boring to you watching me plant these seeds, you can skip on over it like I said I enjoy watching other people uh, plant seeds it's kind of relaxing I guess let me get this a little closer so you guys can see it a little better Putting two seeds per pellet. I'll also be starting my colia seeds. Um, probably today as well. 
because those need to be started indoors 10 to 12 weeks um, before they're ready to go outside. So now is the time. I'm going to go ahead and get these planted and I will be right back guys. Alright, so I actually had a bunch of seeds left over of the champagne. So I'm going to put these guys back in there. I may start another tray or I may just sow the rest of them outside. Like it says. <laughs> Alright, now the next variety. Carnival Rosy Red. Also on the back of these seeds it says uh, sprouts in 10 to 14 days. I'll, ideal temperature is 65 to 90 degrees Fahrenheit. Of course your seed depth is a fourth inch. If you're going to plant these when you or when you get ready to plant them uh, 12 inches apart. Frost hardy, yes. And um, minimum full sun, so 6 to 12 hours at least for hollyhocks. I don't know where those come from. Had a random two seeds here. Alright, so I'm not going to pour them all out. But, looks like a hollyhock seed to me. These are nice and large seeds. Alright, I'm going to get these planted and I'll be right back. Alright, so all these champagne, uh, double champagne hollyhock seeds have been planted. Two rows and then two rows of the uh, Carnival Rosy Red. So, thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you for following along with my indoor seed starting hopefully I have success um, I'll keep you guys posted on these hopefully you're getting ready to or starting your seeds indoors as well hope you're having fun with it um, I believe in the next video I will do coleus I also want to do delphiniums um, got quite a bit that I'm going to be starting indoors from seeds so again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.